In this particular lecture, let's learn how we could add styling to components using regular CSS style sheets. So in order to apply styling, we will be creating a brand new component here. So let's create a new file here and let's call this thing as style sheet component.js and over here let's create that component by typing in export default function that's going to be style sheet component and once that component is created i'll make this thing return another heading inside a div and we will be styling that particular heading but let's say instead of using a heading let's use a simple div here and instead of styling up a heading tag let's say we want to style up this specific div tag itself so let's add some sample text here like this is a style sheet component and then i'll simply go ahead and import that up over here so import that's going to be style sheet component and once that's imported let's add that up over here so once that thing is added you should be able to see that here and now in order to style this specific component what you do is that just like as in html just as we create a brand new style.css file we will be doing exactly the same so in the components folder itself we would actually go ahead and create a new file called as style.css now remember that you could create this file anywhere but just for the sake of simplicity and just for having the two files in the same path i will be creating that file over here itself so i'll create a file call it as style.css and in this particular file just as you would style regular css classes i would do that over here so if i want to style this div i need to add a class name to this so i would say class name here as let's say header and now making use of this class name i can now style this specific component so i would go here i'll access that component using the class name header and once we have access to that, I could style this. So for example, I could set the color property to red. Now here in this particular case, you could write in actual CSS and you don't have to worry writing this kind of a syntax here as we have done in case of inline components. So after writing this, and even after adding the class name header here, this still won't work because what you have to do is that you actually have to import the style sheet over here. And in order to add a style sheet, you need to say import and import the style sheet, which is actually present inside the same directory. So you have to say style.css. So dot forward slash means the current directory and style.css is the name of our file. So if I go back here, as you can see, now the styling has been applied to this specific component. So this is how you could style the components in React using CSS style sheet. And this approach is a lot better as compared to using the inline styling, which we have up over here. Now, apart from this, there's also a third alternative of styling, and that is by using CSS modules. And CSS modules is one of the best ways of styling components. And we are going to learn why that's the best approach in the next lecture. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.